Malcolm, on your trip abroad, you said you sensed a feeling of great brotherhood. While I was at Mecca making the pilgrimage, the, I spoke about the brotherhood that existed at all levels and among all people who were there on that Hajj who had accepted the religion of Islam. And I pointed out that uh, for what it had done, what the religion of Islam had done for those people over there, despite their complexion differences, that it would probably uh, do America well to study the religion of Islam and perhaps it could drive some of, some of the racism from this society as it has driven racism from the Muslim society. When I was in on the pilgrimage, I had close contact with Muslims whose skin would in America be classified as white and with Muslims who would themselves would be classified as white in America. But these particular Muslims didn't call themselves white. They looked upon themselves as human beings, as part of the human family, and therefore they looked upon all other segments of the human family as part of that same family. Well, now, uh, they had a different look or a different air or a different attitude than that which is uh, reflected in the uh, attitude of the man in America who calls himself white. So I said that if uh, Islam had done that for them, Perhaps if the white man in America would study Islam, perhaps it could do the same thing for him.